Hello and welcome back to Pick and Play Sides Round 4 with the Kaiser Reich mod. We are back in Legionnaire, Italy. Now then, a couple of new things have been happening. We have been able to hold off the advantages for the most part. Looks like the Austrians might be leaving a little bit of a gap here again. Hopefully they do. Some of these positions are fairly weak. And down here, we're going to have to give up some of our positions down in this region as their force is just kind of overwhelming. Need to be able to hold on to Trieste because that province is too good for me to lose. This one is okay enough to lose. Frulli itself is too good for me to lose, as well as basically any province that is actually mine. Alta Adige has been mine once again, as well as Triol. We do have one little province in. Meanwhile, over in Ostschweiz. It's still ours. They only took one little province out of it. Then they have Vollarberg, which is I just call it Liechtenstein because that's that's yeah that's not, that's what's there. Luxembourg is up here. Liechtenstein's down there. Then German Empire, you doing anything? No, you restored dualism, and yet Hungary is a social democratic state with just some random guy leading it instead of you. I'm not sure what that's all about. Don't exactly know if I like it. Meanwhile, I also, in during the break, made a couple of new divisions. I made a heavy division for tanks, which is going to be very useful. And I also made a division Fanteria 4 with a tank involved. It was based on the Division Fanteria 2s. So it has a bit of the infantry holding power and a heavy tank. I have made a single unit down here to try and use, try and work with, possibly send it up into the mountains. I'm thinking, because of our heavy emphasis on fighting through these mountains, I can make nine plus of these alpine units. I think I'm going to keep making some of the alpine regiments. Let's make three at a time. Let's make at least three. And come out right now in Lombardia, as I don't know exactly where you're going to go. We're going to need some chromium. Currently, we're getting it from Russian Empire, and that's not so bad. Could get it from the Don Cuban Union. Russian Empire... Ha! Huh, look at that. I have trade that goes through Sultanate of Egypt, whom I'm fighting, down to the to Japan. Probably not the strongest of trade lanes. Let's get eight more out of you. Russian Empire, not much of an empire. Mongols took too much out of you. Wow, they even took Kalar, uh, Kal Kalaria. Yeah, are there names for these? If the Mongols take them, I'm surprised the Mongols have held out so well. You have. Not that many troops compared to all of China, all of Japan. And Japan pushed very hard up through Tibet, taking them out of the war. I'm surprised they lasted so long. But let's get going. This force here needs to fall back. Mm, ooh. Kind of left this force a little bit out in the lurch. Everyone and most of them fall back. Uh, what to do, what to do. Because if this position falls, it kind of all comes down. Which means you spread back out. What was that? Is that spread back out? Come on. New research is available. We can go for an L8 for our light tanks. We can improve our heavy tanks. We could go for El Duce. Which doesn't get a new design, but it is a deep, interesting idea. Breakthrough... A soft attack up, breakthrough up, max speed way down, defense up, hardness way up, hard attack way up, armor way up, production cost insanely high. One factory, one factory has a factory output of five per day. Meanwhile, you have one factory has an output of five per day. Huh, I don't understand, but I guess it'll take five factories to produce one a day. Maybe. I suppose. Even so, it's going to be very expensive for us. Uh, you, you have an even higher production cost. You have a lighter production cost, but not that much. Uh, we could go for... We don't need the higher cannons. We're going for that. It's not 1940 yet. We could go for maintenance company as we are taking a lot of their possessions. Let's see, things I can fall back with. These troops here. Let it go a little bit. Fall back, fall back, fall back. You there. 
Oh, that was those those troops. You fall back. This position is too important for us to lose. Uh, fall back with at least two of these, two of these bad boys. Take them in the morning. Uh, things I can do, not a whole lot in this front. Although, kind of made themselves a little bit weak over here. Start with you, send some of those. Send a couple of these. Try to even out that area. I do not want to lose this position. We have only 34. You attack in. Try it. Did not know that I had left this area so weak. How long until people move? Uh, who's even moving? Everybody go. Come on. Go, go, go. It's going to take what? Uh, supply hours to spare. I don't know. Didn't say. But I just don't want to lose... Uh, I don't want to lose that position. Okay, all army, get over there. I don't want to lose that many units. Oh, good. We had a couple in, but not enough. A couple come in, they fight for a little bit, doesn't last long. Uh, things we can do with that, things we can do. I like where this is going, though. Sending some troops in this area. I don't mind if I lose this entire position so long as most of it holds. How about heavy tanks stay? You go. Light tanks stay. At least one of you stay. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You with your troops try pushing through here. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Over here. You're not gonna make that move. Don't do it. <laughs> this is... I don't like how weak some of these positions are. However, looks like that attack's turning around. Some of these attacks are turning around, surprisingly. Set those armies to go. Set this army to go, for now, just to hold them. Uh, you on, you're on low, you're on low. So I'm not going to attack that hard. You're all currently staying, good. I can send back at least one of these units. Go help out. You somehow can't get in there. It uh, looks like we have to fall back out of that position. It's all right. Not the worst thing in the world. As for you, get on another that attack. You, get back in there. Get back in there. Losing that province. Annoying, but... Mm, yeah, annoying, but so, sometimes sacrifices have to be made. Looks like we might lose this province next. How many troops are in this? Uh, about 8 to 10. Just hurt them while they stand there. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. We've actually taken a piece of that province. Something we haven't done in a long time. Now, we're not going to really be able to hold it that well, but it's nice to have some thought. These attacks aren't doing too good. And now your line... Huh. You, I suppose you could have part of your line on this side. Hmm. So long as this province is there. What? What exactly did you... How? How'd you break that province? Also, is that another attack? Ooh, what's this? Equality push through their lines. I mean, I like it. Well, what actually is it? It's an attack from us led by the tanks into that province. You guys move around, get to your positions. Maybe you stop your attacks. Then again, we had this force to hold, so it's not the worst thing. On this side, this attack isn't doing so well. However, your attack, you, your attack should be focused right there. And probably get rid of this attack, just because of it. If you could try that attack, you could try an attack. If you and your troops could try an attack. No, any troop that's in Trieste needs to hold, though. Mm-hmm. Good, good. Over here, this position is holding quite well. 
That will ease up our lines quite a lot. Now we have this. Oh, it's too many units to try and push through at once. Like, that attack just wouldn't work at all. Just hold them back. Hmm. It's too much to go through. However, pushing through, taking back Alta Deji, and taking Trento, very nice to have, very nice to hold. This province, they keep going in, they keep getting pushed out. It's funny. Looks like they're moving their lines. Hmm. You there, consider for a second, holding that line area too. Good, 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 good. Oh, we have retaken our lands. Fruly lands are ours again. Mmm, tasty. As for this, how about a line to Laibach again? As for you, your line will be same, Laibach and Fruly. Uh, you are supposed to be pushing. However, how about instead of this area, right in... Ooh, ooh, we could get three lines of attack on that one province. I like it. Try its spearhead to there. With your troops, get into position, everybody get ready. Well, this army still just needs to hold Zerek line. This army still holding, I like it, I like it a lot. At the moment, hold your attack. Also, get rid of your old line. New line, eh, no, new line will be up here. It'll be that kind of push area. I do enjoy the fact that we were able to push through there. Although the sheer number of troops we've had to push through is certainly not something I enjoy. Our win ratio is down, but our, we still, eh, those combined still about 20,000 less equipment loss in the same number of period. Hmm. You guys will need to come out. Ooh, a third battleship. Patrol, search and destroy in the straight. We'll take the fight straight to him. As for you with your tanks, everyone get position. Aha, uh -huh, there's the fleet. There's their two battleships. We're going to see how it does. Which makes me think, just for this one moment, you got some fighters there. Go over. You. Uh, no, you're just on Thornmo. You go naval strike, not port strike, just naval strike. There, any tactical fire, tactical bombers go naval strike into the sea. Her oh, heron of the sky, Negroni, she died. No, nope, we need someone not a fleet. Uh, doesn't matter. It was kind of to be expected, I suppose. Over here, I want everybody on naval strikes at the moment. For the battle in the sea. There we go. A few of them coming in. These attacks are going fine. Hmm. Ten divisions there. Just wait for it. Wait for it. Let's have that open. Battle of the Adriatic Sea. New research available. No. What? No. Oh, yes. Um... Uh, Infantry organization up and tanks organization up. That's very important for fighting in these mountain conditions. Resources need more chromium. I could get it from Empire Japan. I could get it from Turkey. How about Empire Japan? Available 55 factories. I like that. So, three to one casualties. Uh, we're going after light ships first. Don't necessarily like that. How about you can't do anything else? You can go over there. Everybody we got is currently going to be fighting this region. How about... No. Oh, we got naval bombers. Naval bombers are perfect. It's exactly what I want. Come out in Ruma. Hmm. These divisions aren't necessarily all that strong. 
Uh, strong enough to hold against the Germans, I suppose. Yes, we've knocked out a good number of their ships. 98%, 97%, 98%. All of our... Yep. There goes one of their heavy cruisers. There goes two of their heavy cruisers. Now we're just three against two and a bunch of screen ships. Uh, we're, uh, both sides are piling in aircraft. Ooh, they're even trying a sneaky naval invasion. But we have the superior number of battleships, and they just have pre Weltkriegs. We're definitely winning the engagement, though how much we're going to win is anyone's guess. We only have these to lose now. One of our battleships is going back. We sank one of their battleships. Another one, possibly. It looks like all of our planes are gone. Ooh, what's this? A possible invasion? Hmm. The other one's got repelled pretty well. You are at 39%. Kind of the air power is a bit too much, and the fact that we have lost a lot of our fighters. Yeah, you are basically destroyed immediately. You, all of them are basically destroyed immediately. Oh god, they are all dead. Spend those air wings. You, get back to power region. You keep up the fight. You keep up in power region. You in here. Everybody pull back. Go that sea for now. You, that region. You, that region. Everybody pull out of the Adriatic Sea. With these ships, they are 92% and 72%. That's not bad, although the amount of planes against us is certainly annoying. That is their... Ooh, yes, the second battleship down. Now it's just three in retreat, mostly just fighting against submarines. As for the Italian theater, hmm, looks like we might need to pull off some of our troops from different locations to go and deal with this as they are going to land And my shore. Possibly the first time ever. An actual proper landing in one of our beachheads. Meanwhile, up here, Italian Theater, you there, go, go, you, you don't have any plans, but how about a big old go from you, go carefully, you with your troops, not to be outdone, how about a big go for a grand spring offensive? Go, go. Kind of all destroyed along the board, but it's for attrition. Naval battles. Five, on our side, five destroyed destroyers. Most of our bombers, tactical bombers, and close air support bombers. And on this side, both of their battleships, both of their heavy cruisers, all of their destroyers, and the majority of their light cruisers. Nice. Ooh, Medicals Horthy. Why are you with the... Uh, well, maybe I'm thinking too much into it. On their side, they survived with the majority of the tactical bombers and close air support. Most of the undamaged pre U-boats and one light cruiser at 6%. Oh, it's a good day to be us. Yeah, you, come on home. Come on back to base. You did good. You done good. Hmm. Let's see, you hold your offensive, you hold your offensive, you go with your offensive. You can keep it up. You go down to careful, you should be on careful, careful, you going to careful. As long as the defenses hold, I'm fine. This is basically attack. Hmm. Now why can they hold? It's because they have insane amounts of defense with 200% modifiers being entrenched in, in the mountains. They have foreign reserve. Just kind of pile in troops that can't stop us. Now then, yes, the invasion of the Greeks is certainly annoying. 
Well, time to call upon our troops. Call upon them. As for our recruitment and deploy, write in Emilia. One, two, three, f no, five, six, no, just five. Five should be enough to handle this, for now. Encircle, destroy, do whatever you need to do. 500 army experience that I'm not going to use at any point. Ooh, I like the first cracking of this egg. Then there's these attacks, which are just kind of to stall. A beautiful, beautiful battle. Let's see the ending results. You, hmm, you were able to be the final shot in the SMS Hunyari. And on a heavy cruiser Fumi. Ooh, they are getting saucy trying to name it after our rightful territory. Good. Then you, who has already served very well, you took out the SMS Corvinus. And you, mostly just destroyers, destroyers, and then also helped take out the Corvinus. Nice. Veteran crews, as well as this guy who managed to survive and helped take out one of the destroyers. Nice. How's our production going? And also, probably should do this before I forget. Legionnaire Italy fleet. You're making four a year. You're making that many a year. Have you stop it there? Making one a year. I knew that all it would take is to forget that last one. And this is a medium anti-air. Okay, put that in. I don't think I've lost any land. Hmm. It's hard to say. Only making one a day is very difficult for us. Yeah, all these heavy, all these expensive things are difficult to make in large quantities when they all die immediately. But with that, thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode where we'll take care of those Greeks trying to invade the Bologna and we'll hopefully take out all those troops who have been vacationing in Switzerland for so long. Bye-bye!